Okay, so I have my text block in uh, the planner right now, okay? We are going to go through this and pass it a couple times and uh, I'm just gonna show you how to cut with, with it, okay? So every time you go back and forth, you're just gonna trim a portion of your paper, okay? It, you're just gonna go slowly, okay? In each pass you make, you just want to turn your knot up here, about a quarter of a turn, quarter to half a turn, okay? Push it forward. Let's pull it back. Okay. So I'm getting close to the nylon. track right now. Okay. I'm just going to pull my paper out. So once we get to this point, I'm just going to try to do slower turns, keep on pulling it back. Okay. I don't want to extend past the paper over on the side. because Sometimes the blade gets caught once we get down this far. So I'm just going to keep on making these passes, these little turns with the nut on the top. I'm just going to keep on pulling it back. Okay. And there we go. So once I get to that point, I'm going to pull my knife up. Okay. I want to make sure that it's all the way up so that we don't cut ourselves when we take out our text block. There we go. It's all the way up now. So if anybody runs their hand over there, we aren't going to cut ourselves. Okay, so down on the bottom, again, we have these clamps here that have clamped down our text block. We're just going to release those. We're going to take out our text block, okay? Okay, there we go. I'm also going to release this edge at the back so I can pull it out a little bit easier. And there's our nice clean edge for our spine. Okay, remember our spine is the first thing that we're going to cut, and then we're going to stick it into the book press, okay, to perfect bind it. 